This is our uh, Weird World Aquarium filled with uh, Opaula, Hawaiian uh, red shrimp, indigenous to Hawaii in the uh, semi salt ponds that uh, are on the island. I bought these a few years back from a place called Fuka Banzai in Hawaii. And as you can see, it's a biorb tank that I'm using, eight gallons. And right next to it is a um, six inch ecosphere sealed unit. Uh, that thing's gone on probably about two years plus. And uh, shrimp are doing fine in there. I did remove the seal, put a little plastic plug in the top, as you can see, so I can feed them. Feed them about once a week, pinch of uh, dried uh, algae that I bought from Fuku Banzai. It's shrimp food. And uh, here it is, right here. Just a little bottle of it. Last probably a year. Uh, you don't overfeed these guys or the tank will become polluted and your shrimp will die. So uh, basically you can not feed them for a month if you are away, no problem. They eat the bacteria and the algae that grow in the tank. So I set up uh, this 8 gallon tank and I'll zoom in here a little bit. You can see on one of the pieces of lava that I have in there, they're all clustered. They're very social fish, or crustaceans actually. They like to be together. I just put a little pinch of, uh, of the food in there. I'll try to get up there at the top, and you can see them filter feeding. They go up there and they basically pick the... Uh, the uh, floating algae off the uh, surface film it floats on the top there and they'll do that till every bit of it is gone they've just discovered it's up there and they're a little smarter than you'd think they can see it or, or sense it and they'll swim right to the top and greedily eat that stuff till it's all gone And this is like I mentioned a biorb tank. I got it off eBay, about 80 bucks. Works great for this purposes. There is a um, air pump which draws air up through the tube in the center through a uh, filter that's mounted down in the gravel. It's a sponge filter. And that takes care of uh, the water, keeps it pretty much crystal clear. Uh, there's also a intelligent light that uh, cycles from a blue night light to uh, the white LEDs that you see that are on to illuminate the tank for a cycle. You can set that. And that's our, our tank with the uh, Opaula Hawaiian Red Shrimp. Uh, like I said, I bought them from Fuku Banzai in Hawaii. You can go online Google their website. Uh, they sell actually completed tanks with the shrimp. And uh, they're about 60 or $70 as I recall. I just put them in here. And my shrimp, contrary to what uh, I've been told and read online about them being hard to breed and hard to raise, I found these shrimp... Uh, to breed prolifically I've had at least two spawnings and I'd say uh, from the original 20 or so shrimp there's at least 60 or 70 shrimp in here now um, there, there's quite a bit more than what I started with so they're a good little tank really low maintenance um, feed them once a week um, there's a little magnetic um, scraper here that you can go down and 
clean the sides of it. Uh, you do that maybe once a month. And other than that, you don't touch it, you don't mess with it. And uh, maybe do a 50% water change uh, once a year. That's it. So, I recommend them. Get a tank, set it up on your desk. It's, it's, a, it's a nice low maintenance uh, aquarium that you can have. And these little shrimp are quite active and quite fun to watch. They live, I've been told, 15 to 20 years. And I have no reason to doubt that. And if you have an ecosphere or another sealed unit, I would recommend uh, removing the plug and putting in some sort of uh, removable plug that you can uh, drop a little food in there once in a while and uh, extend the life of your ecosphere probably double it and again you can also do a 50 percent water change uh, there's information on Fuku Bonsai's website and uh, you can uh, get the water density the proper mixture you get the uh, salt from any aquarium store and uh, mix up fresh uh, seawater for them and um, do a little water change once in a while that will also help extend the life of your um, of your shrimp colony so hope you enjoy the video thanks